everyone. How have you all been? Hope you've all been keeping well and warm since then, like mid mid December. Welcome back to part eight of Detroit. We're all getting ready for Christmas and New Year's, I believe. Yeah. Um, in the last couple of chapters, we were playing. We we were bringing Marcus back to life. Uh, putting him, putting the pieces back together, you know. Um, and we escaped the junkyard, and then okay, just gonna quickly, just gonna pause it for a quick minute. Um, and then we moved on to Connor, and he met Amanda. Well, we met Amanda. Apparently, I feel like they've they've known each other for quite a while, for for a little while at least. But yeah, um, we annoyed Hank some more, unintentionally. <laughs> but yeah, I guess we're back as Kara and Alice, or Kara, protecting Alice. Let's continue. I I really regret sleeping in the car with her. I wish we found somewhere more safe. And I feel like we didn't even need to steal those clothes. I wish we could give it back. Along with that chocolate bar. I'm guessing it's melted by now. I'll cut hair. I'm sorry, I hope ah, I feel so terrible. I've said this before, but I really do wish these two, at least, mainly Alice, has an happy ending. What are we doing? Explore area, trick neighborhoods. Change appearance, cut hair. Death to androids. People really don't like androids. I'm guessing it's people. Oh, what? Really? Didn't even notice that guy before. Probably because it was too dark. Detroit, the Cyber Life. Cyber wild, li cyber wild life. First Android Zoo opens. US life expectancy now 91. 0.4% of world population holds 94% of global wealth. Canada. Canada is still Android free zone. Canada where the air is clean and the, and the welcome is always warm. <laughs> discover the landscape. Discover the wild. Discover Canada. Despite the United States voting in its Android Act, as early as 2028, the Canadian Parliament has again has yet again punished, but has has yet again pushed back its decision on whether to permit Androids in the country. As a result, Androids are still not sold in Canada and have no official status in the country. With androids continuing to fuel unpre unprecedented growth in the US economy, yet contributing to records, yet contributing to record levels of unemployment, the arguments for and against putting them on a sale in Canada rages on. But for the time being, Canada remains an android free zone. Interesting.
New hair color. Um, I feel like she would suit either one of these really, except white. I'm gonna go with blonde. Um, blonde and brown. Yeah, why not? Or I guess. No, back to blonde. Even though it doesn't actually look blonde. Is it giving us the option to look at all of them? Why not? That does not look like white. Just go back to blonde and leave it at that. Yeah. Finish. What are we removing? Oh. Are we doing what Marcus did? Oh, cool. Is no one... Cut, cut hair and remove legs? Cool. Check neighborhoods. Wait, I want to check Alice before we... She's still sleeping. Okay. I think we're good. Oh, wow, it's busy in the daytime. I'm guessing we need to go to Alice now, but I'm just gonna check here just in case. Okay. I'm presuming this, they've been sleeping for about five hours, roughly. I'm not too sure though. saw yesterday he gave me an address he said we could get help there the train passes just on the other side of the road the station can't be far you feel okay to walk a little let's go then did she even answer I don't think she did You're pretty like that. You really look like a human now. No, I should know this. But do we have to go on the main through the main road? Yes, I might do. You've got officers sweeping the neighborhood in case anybody saw anything. Okay, well, let me know if they turn anything up. What are you gonna do with that? I have no idea. Sorry. It took the first bus that came along and stayed at the end of the line. Its decision wasn't planned. It was driven by fear. Androids don't feel fear. Deviants do. They get overwhelmed by their emotions and make irrational decisions. 
Alright, well that still doesn't tell us where it went. Are we it playing didn't have a plan? And it had nowhere to go. Maybe it didn't go far. Maybe. Are we playing as Connor now? What's going on? Oh no, we're still okay. Come on. Danger like a sneak past cops. Okay. Holds. I guess it goes straight. That seems like the best. Hide. Okay. Oh, we need to, okay. We need to go right, I guess. So. Oh, that was close. Okay, we're good. Um, I should cross, what am I doing? Wait, should I cross? Oh, sorry, wait. <laughs> oh no. Okay, I hope that didn't attract attention. Unwanted attention especially. Hey, we can see. Yeah. Okay, this is starting to get more intense than it already has been. Come on. Do they know what we look like? I mean, I'm sure they do. They won't get far. We'll find it sooner or later. Are you sure about Let's that? Go. I mean, these guys aren't, like, you know, the bad guys or. So I wouldn't really be that bothered if they found this, but then again I don't want them to split up Alice and Carl. Okay, made it. These two's bond is so powerful. Uh, run, Carl, run. Okay. Um, on the run. Morning in parking lot, thirty one percent. Find some rusted scissors, cut and colour hair. Find, okay. Car and Alice in the street. Walk toward train station. Walk past police forces. Reach the train safely. Hmm. 
Hmm, okay. Let's continue, I guess. Several sources report that CyberLife has provided Detroit police with a prototype detective android. Although police assistant androids have been... Like his markers. That explains, like, you know, the previous, previous part. He's and Marcus back together. It explains why he had different color eyes in the trailer. To replace one of his eyes, obviously. Hands out. Yeah, I remember. Okay. I don't know where that symbol came from. Look for graffiti. Okay, it's a it's a guy with a load of red around them. They missed them. Uh, I just came from the junkyard. If I had some, I would honestly love to help. Oh, it's right there. If I, I want to look around a bit. Oh, okay. I didn't really get a good look at that, but at that one. Looks like a lion, half a lion's face. Okay. Follow trail to Jericho. Cyberlife's fortune telecomputer. Cyberlife develops world's most powerful quantum calculator. Android soul just perfect killing machines. Cyberlife develops most powerful, powerful, most powerful quantum calculator. Cyberlife has unveiled a new quantum supercomputer capable of exaflops one billion, one billion billion operators per second, the equivalent of se several human minds in a single machine. The computer was specifically designed to analyze vast data from various sources and generate predictions. Philip Seymour, Cyberlife's d director of Futuro Futurology, is highly confident. We've been testing for a while, and the results are going to be are going to wow people. The computer will be used to calculate the probability of mass extinction events, such as aggr aggressive alien invasions or global climate disasters like meteors or su super viruses. The computer can then help us to antici anticipate the and prepare for such cal calamities, ensuring humanity is never caught off guard, despite doomsday predictions from those fearful that AI is gaining too much influence already. Many experts are hailing this is a quantum leap in applied artificial intelligence. Android astronauts to explore IO NASA sends Android in crew into space. Hackers target solar panels for for latest ransom scam. NASA NASA announced the launch of a five Android crew to explore Io, one of Jupiter's satellites. The journey will last three years and is expected expected to teach us more about formation of our solar system. Though not the first androids in space, this is the first all machine crew. For Proving that androids are sufficiently reliable to be entrusted in the in with the entire mission. Androids are, extra are an extraordinary asset for the con conquest of space, said Michael Shelley, director of NASA. Cosmic radiation destroys human DNA. Humans suffer f suffer many effects from long-term space travel, while androids are immune to most of these issues. Um, 
NASA confirmed to confirm no return journey was planned and that the androids would work on Io for several months before being destroyed by the extreme conditions of the planet. Do you know where Jericho is? I sure I probably shouldn't have been. They never talk back, the ones that are parked and like by the bus stop. anything so I know we have to go that way I just want to check if there's anything sorry I'm stuck I can't walk that way wow okay am I just wasting my time going this way yep okay let's just go to go to where we need to I guess I'm sorry, I would have occurred. You got that artist to call me. Iron's android killed him. Oh, you heard wrong. I read it somewhere. Well, don't believe everything you read. Thank you. I like the girl. She has a mind of her own. I think it's her. Oh, there it is. the other one? Oh, right there. A robot. Okay, a red robot. Oh, it's right there. One more. There's got to be one here somewhere. Um. Oh wait. Go on, you just look more suspicious. Suspicious crouch in there. Wait, I didn't find the third one though. Is it behind? Oh okay. So a window. Wait, that's one? Really? It doesn't look like one. Actually, it just looks inverted. Um, find a way to reach the roof. Let me use this. Nice. That was quick. Oh, 
I was about to say sparkle or something. Can we jump there? Mm. The way you climbed up that roof, I'm, I'm guessing you can make this. Proof and show. It's kind of new too, we haven't done anything like that before. Okay, I'm guessing there's nothing in here. There it is. Well, some of them are hidden. Oh, right there, that one's not hidden. inside somewhere This is just like introducing the new controls or something. But yeah, it's cool. I'm liking that it's not like sticking to the same. It's pressing square for some reason. It's like further inside the building, whatever. Why do I have to keep? Looking for these symbols. I guess this is a very like secretive place we're going to, I guess. Um, I don't know. Yeah. Jericho, oh, did we find it? Maybe. It's a ship. Oh. Reach the boat. What's the boat? I feel like boats are. Oh. Not gonna happen. Yep. That did just happen. Find another way to the boat. Okay. Okay, I guess we do have to go up. Last look, that is one big boat. Before we climb. Okay, yep, we're climbing. 
I don't do amazingly with heights, but I think we should be okay. <laughs> Okay. No, I don't like this angle. This is not okay. Jump? Are you crazy? Okay, it's just water. We're in the boat now. This is one creepy looking boat. Lock. Okay. Okay, we'll go this way. What is that noise? This is not a horror game. Please stop acting like one. Okay. We can do this. It's just a abandoned boat. What is with those noises? Explore the boat. Yeah, I'm trying. There's nothing. Oh, RA9. Am I gonna get jump scared soon? I can feel it coming. <laughs> Fuck! Oh no. no. This is not a horror game, stop! Oh, that was good though. I expected it, but it still got me. Ah, oh, okay. What is with all these lines? Is it because we like put ourselves back together or something? I don't know. I feel like these, like you know, these lines weren't there before. I feel like someone did that on purpose. Yeah. Come on, we're on the same side, right? <laughs> Welcome to Jericho. Oh, I remember you. Well, I recognize that face. Kind of looks familiar a little bit. Cool, okay, so we found Jericho. Or, oh, I don't know if that's a play of if that's a place or a person or 
I'm guessing that's a person. But, oh, actually, it could be either or. Ask Android the waiter. Yeah, that was pretty pointless. Oh, we missed something to read. Damn. So locate Jericho. So is Jericho? Oh yeah, Jericho is the ship, the boat. It, c it still could be a person too. I mean, who knows? Maybe you guys do. I I clearly don't. Okay, so I'm guessing the last. Five or six things were supposed to happen. Yeah. Thanks for watching, guys. Hope you have a wonderful Christmas and a amazing Happy New Year, just in case I don't upload a video before then. Yeah. Stay safe. Peace.